Hi everybody, it's Melissa with It's a Life, and I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you guys tonight. And I have found a lot of cool things, not all like that everybody else has found, but still way cool stuff in my opinion. So let's go ahead and get into it. I'm just going to be pulling random things out of bags. I picked up these two pot holders for the lemon giveaway. And I am going to be getting that together really soon and I'm going to go ahead and announce it hopefully before my surgery on the 21st. That's what I'm shooting for. So cross fingers, toes, uh, eyes. <laughs> because I am uh, scheduled for back surgery on the 21st. And um, again, it's been a minute since I've recorded not as long as last time because life is starting to settle down a little bit, but I've not been feeling really well. But anyway, you guys didn't come here for all that. You came here to see the stuff I got from the Dollar Tree. So, I picked up these, these stickers from Crafter Square, the 14 piece. I thought those were really pretty and I like the metallic puffy look to them. I picked up this. 14 piece with the dream catchers and the it says dream and love or no not love dream and hope and I'm not sure what this one selfie I think that says selfie but I thought those were really pretty and then I picked up these that do say love they are also metallic puffy stickers and they are a 13 piece and then a 12 piece and this is family and sweet home and enjoy every day I thought these were super pretty I wanted them in my stash even though so much has been going on a lot of things have been going to storage there's this massive box beside me that came from Amazon that has a new mattress in it for my bed because the whole surgery thing. <laughs> I need a better bed. Really bad. And I'm kind of scared, so if you guys would keep me in your prayers, thoughts, send good vibes, you know. I got these Ioni 3D Faux Mink Lashes and the Wispy Full Dramatic. those were really pretty too. I picked up one in a melon notebook for a friend of mine and a lot of my stuff that I was intending to send off has went to storage inadvertently so hopefully after surgery I can start getting that stuff together. Then I got squeeze the day which is also for the lemon giveaway. So I should keep that separated so I can decide what I'm sticking in the box. I found this little Hot Wheels, and I don't usually pick up Hot Wheels because G-Cat really isn't into them much anymore. Well, he never really was a toy kid. He was more into reading and electronics. And But I picked up this little taco truck because I thought it was cute, and I might send it to a friend, not sure. Then I got these I this Ioni lash glue. I've not tried their lash glue yet. I have tried the lashes though. I like the lashes. I got a bunch of makeup in here. So we'll get to that in a minute. I got one of these suave tropical paradise deodorants. I think it's a deodorant. Let me see. Yes, antiperspirant deodorant which means it's probably full of all the bad things, but every once in a while I use, because it, it smells really good, but I uh, use antiperspirant deodorant sometimes. Um, a lot of times I use natural deodorant. I really like Lumi, but it is expensive, so when I can't afford it, I just get that. I got 
a wet and wild mega cushion and this is for the redness and it's the green tinted one I picked up one of these wet and wild mega last liquid cat suit and it is in lavender crown I believe it's hard to see my eyes are getting worse and my glasses aren't cutting it anymore I picked up one of the wet and wild mega last liquid cat suits and honestly I cannot see it so you guys if you can see it but it's this glittery purpley color and then I picked up the liquid cat suit in once upon a bronze moon I think it is I don't know not for total sure but there's that I picked up one of the mega last liquid cat suits I'm, I'm not sure. I cannot see it. I should have brought some magnifying glasses in here. Actually, I think I got some in another bag. I don't, don't know if I can put my hands on them real quick. Let me see if I can. Um, uh -huh. Yes. Okay. I picked up these magnifying glasses and this is in the point or the 2.75 magnification and I'm going to open them and slip them on so I can read these things so if you guys see a color that you like you can look for it I'm not even going to take off the stickers and I'm going to put them over my other ones okay I picked up one of the wet and wild Liquid cat suits in Ruby Heist. What's that? I think that's so pretty. And I can read the other ones that I didn't. This one is Fairy Tale Ending. That was this one. And this purpley one is When Stars Align. So there's that one. And I think I was able to read the other ones. Yeah, once, once in a bronze moon. Let me see what this one is. Ruby Heist. And Lavender Crown. So those are those. And then I got this LA Colors Eyeliner and Brow Pencil in black. I haven't even been messing with my eyebrows lately. I they probably need plucked like super bad, but haven't done that lately. I got one of these Wet n Wild. Uh, looks like it says Idle Eyes. It's got a, a the the packaging on it. And let me see. Looks like it's. I am not sure. I can't see because of the packaging, but I'm not going to open it right now because I think it'll take too long and I got quite a bit to go through. I got one of these uh, mega cushions from Wet n Wild in this purpley color. Oh, it's called Bubblegum in Paradise. So it might be more of a pink color. I got this Wet n Wild Mega Glow Hello Halo and it is Goddess Glow. I was really super excited to find all this makeup. I love makeup. I've not been wearing my makeup lately but I got this Wet n Wild Mega Glow Highlighting Powder in Royal Calyx. So pretty. Can't wait to play with that. See, there's two more items in here. I got the Wet n Wild Mega Cushion in the sort of yellow tone, and it's to brighten dullness. And then I got 
this Wet n Wild lipstick in Vamp It Up. It was kind of a blackish, reddish purple. <laughs> oh, and I got this Suave Roseberry and Mint Deodorant, which is formulated without aluminum. So kind of excited to try that. I don't know if I can get it open to smell it. I cannot smell it. Oh, now I can. It is very minty. Very minty. So we'll give that a shot. And if you guys want my reviews on any of these things, let me know. Okay, take the glasses back off my head or off my eyes for a minute. I got these Crafter Square 16 piece stickers in the candies. I thought these were adorable. I just love those. And then I found these voila, voila, not voila. I don't know what I'm thinking tonight. It is super late and I am tired, but I wanted to come on and chat with you guys and show you what I found. The voila treat sacks and it's a three piece and it says best day ever. And G cat runs around and says that when he's excited, he's like, it was the best day ever, mommy. So, I picked those up because I just thought they were adorable. I am going to go ahead and open them so y'all can see what they look like. Oh, those are so cute. Like a little drawstring and they're a burlap. Those are nice. I like those. They had, um, I think they were black stripes, like horizontal. Or no, horizontal's that way. Vertical. <laughs> I think I think it's late <laughs> you guys can correct me I don't care um, but they had black striped and they had I think a red or a pink stripe too at my store but I this is the only one I picked up and I found this notebook and I thought it was really cool looking with this kind of psychedelic snake pattern on it and this is by Kittrich, Kit, Kittrich Corporation. And it seems to be a pretty nice notebook. I think Theone from Thrifty Divas found these. I don't remember the snake though. She might not have picked up the snake. She said there was one or two that I think that she didn't get. And then I picked up this Highlights Hidden Pictures, Fun Stuff to Find and Color because I love these books and I might need things to do while I'm laid up for a while after back surgery. I got this cosmetic bag that's sweet as a melon that I bought for a gift. That's the inside. I thought that was really cute. I need to find all the things that went to storage and bring them home so I can pack them up. Hopefully, I can do that soonish after surgery. Hopefully, um, I got this large print crosswords because I thought it would be something interesting to do, and I can I can hopefully see that. <laughs> and then I got the large print board finds, and again, that's pretty big print. I think I can see it. I got this advanced coloring inspirational quotes relax and uh, and rewind I wanted to say unwind but this one says don't be a tourist be a traveler and a smile is the prettiest thing you can wear so here's a couple pages out of that I just thought this was really neat and then this is inspirational quotes, advanced coloring. Every day may not be good, but there is something good in every day. And these are by Binden. So here's a, a page. You are stronger than you think. And then grab another page to show you. Shine like a star. So things that I can do while laying around recovering, I guess. 
I picked up, I think I picked up four of these. Cecil the Crab. And these are different. Um, they got a new collection that's more aquatic, ocean themed or whatever. But I got four of the crabs because if you guys have been here for a while, you know that I have quite a few hermit crabs. And I just thought that was cute. I mean, obviously he's not a hermit crab. Even though I could glue one of the old shells on the back here and make him into a hermit crab. I just thought this was adorable. So I got like four of them. Because I'll probably send them off as gifts so people can think of crabby old me in my zoo that I got going on. Oh, I found these. Aren't these cute? I used to wear these like, well, they were silver framed and I think darker lenses, but I used to wear glasses like this all the time when I was younger because I am a big Aussie fan and I always thought they looked adorable on me. Probably not so much, but so try these on for you guys. Let's see what they look like together. It's been a long time since I wore glasses like this. What do you guys think? I like them. They probably aren't, it says UV 400. I don't know how good that is. I got these sparkly cutlery set in 24 pieces. And these do feel really sturdy. And besides, they're pretty. And then I got the little eight piece plates to match because I just thought that they were pretty and maybe I'll eat my little snacks or whatever while I'm recovering on <laughs> home. I don't know. I got two of these on the border cafe style tortilla chips and it is a it's a little bag. I mean you're probably better off going to Walmart and getting the big bag but it's net weight four ounces but this is basically a serving for my boyfriend or my son. So <laughs> I picked up a pack of these disposable face masks and it's a 10 pack. And I know that everybody's lifting the mask mandate, but um, you know, there are places that you're still gonna be required to wear them. So got that. And I got this desktop arcade ball. So I thought maybe I could sit and play with that. Maybe me and G-Cat. I like the arcade ball in the arcade. I love it. That's one of my favorite things to do. So I'm going to open it so you guys can see it. Oh, it's so cute. Comes in three pieces. Let me see if I can figure out how to put it together. Let's see. Um, hmm. Got to be brighter than the than the um the product here. Okay. Oh, okay. I was trying to put it together backwards because that's how I do. That is really cute. Look, I like it. And then you have these. Where'd they go? Oh. And then you have these ball bearings. To use as the little balls. Huh, that is cute. I like it. I I really do always want to pick up their little their little games like this. I always think they're adorable. Usually I hold off on it, but I couldn't resist this time. Another Cecil the Crab. I found these Centicorns eight scented markers. I thought maybe I could use those in my coloring book. Let's see if they really smell good. I don't know. Should we open them? Do you guys want me to open them? I don't know. If this is running kind of long, but I think I'll give a couple of them a sniff just to see. Oh, they actually do smell good, you guys. <laughs> that smells like grape. The purple one. Let's see. 
this kind of smells like rotten chocolate, the black one, to me. I'll smell one more and then we'll move on. And the blueberry smells like maybe get a cotton candy, a really light, that's got a really light scent. But I'm pleased for a dollar, you know, eight scented markers. They had um, scented gel pens and some other, I think, scented notebooks and things, but I didn't pick them up. I picked up two more of these Spa Works Hydrating Makeup Cleansing Wipes with goat's milk and hyaluronic acid. And these are the 60 wipes. So I picked up two more of those. And I think I already had two, I'm pretty sure. I got this little purse play set and it's ages three and up and there's seven pieces. I got this for Steve's grandbaby because she is adorable and I think she'd like that. Got another Cecil crab and the other thing of makeup removing white. We are down to the last couple items. Yay! I ended up getting, since I'm putting a lot of things in storage and in the garage, I ended up getting these Jot 120 piece file, photo, file folder labels to put on bins. I got another scrub brush for the kitchen because I actually started using the one that I had just like this for the cat's um, water fountain bowl because it gets pretty nasty and so I want this one for our dishes and then I got this crown jewels list pad 50 sheets and it is squeeze the day for the lemon giveaway it doesn't have a magnet on the back but I mean magnets are cheap you could just glue one on the back maybe if you wanted but anyway that's the end of this haul um, keep in mind, I'm going to try to get the giveaway together and um, pick a name, hopefully. I'm, I'm shooting for the 21st, and um, I've got so much stuff, I have to decide what I'm going to put in the box. And if I got more, I might do another one. I mean, why not, right? Because, uh, you know, you guys that have stuck through me, stuck with me, Goodness, I am so tired. I don't know if you guys can tell. I am tired. I've been in a lot of pain. But, you know, you guys have stuck with me through all this crazy. So, you deserve a nice giveaway. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get off here because we're at 23 minutes already. So, until I see you again, stay safe. Take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And there's Pugsley. But remember, always, much love. Mm. Bye.